Salutations, friends and strangers of the interwebs. Welcome back to the channel, Stevie Wonder Woman. I am said Stevie. Um, in this video, I'm going to talk about my wallet. So, um, I got a new one. I'll unbox it and or unpackage it in just a second. This came from Urban EDC Supply. Um, so I'm always looking for a new wallet and, um, I haven't been able to find a, a good replacement. I recently, uh, picked up a, um, Travax, uh, a Travax, uh, wallet. I really wanted to like it. Didn't work out for me. Um, I got a Ridge wallet. Didn't work out for me. Um, I've had this leather magnetic money clip wallet now for about eight years. And it's a nice minimalist wallet. Everything I need is in this wallet. And uh, it's suiting suited me really well. But I'm always looking for something uh, that can replace it, potentially. I might have found that. So uh, right now, I currently... Uh, I like having uh, the window on the ID... So I can just flash that real quick. That that's always handy, you know. Decent uh, decent feature. I'm also it's also has a slot. The slot in here can hold. Um, these are like my concealed carry permits and uh, my uh, plumbing uh, training license. Um, it's got a, enough uh, spots to hold one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six cards. I have a spot to tuck in my uh, Lynch Northwest All Access Pass. That um, always comes in handy. It's a nice spot to carry. And then it's got this money clip right here. It's a magnetic money clip. I'm able to just fold a couple of uh, bills in half. And boom. And then... I have uh, super glued a while back a, a coin to that. That is the faceless man of Valor Magulis. Magulis for high. I forget how to say it. It's from Game of Thrones. I'm a big fan, but I can never pronounce that. Um, uh, it's just a coin that I have uh, super glued on there. So this wallet suits me very well. It's very functional. Um, very minimalist. I carry this in my front left pocket. No longer a back pocket. Um, it's not an RFID. Is that the name of it? An RFID, RFID blocker. Uh, I have in the past just carried a RFID uh, blocking um, card in here to help with that. But maybe I should be more worried about that. And I'm just not. Um, so that's not a big deal to me. There's been, uh, recently, uh, Lynch Northwest has come out with a wallet. They've done a collaboration. Um, it's their All Access Pass wallet that, uh, um, will help, uh, it functions as a wallet, and then you can also slide your All Access Pass into there. So, um, I've really wanted to get one of those, but, uh, I've missed out on both the drops. So, I saw this on, uh, Urban, uh, Supply, Urban EDC Supply. And um, I'm subscribed to their uh, um, their text messages, and uh, I got a text message saying, "Hey, we got a certain collection that is 20% uh, off right now." Um, and uh, I also had a $25 gift card uh, that I redeemed from all the stuff that I bought for them uh, this year. So um, this is uh, real quick. It comes with uh, just a standard. Urban EDC Supply uh, card. Thank you for your support. But this specifically is the uh, Urban Companion Black 3-slot wallet. And I thought that this looked very interesting. So, as you can see here, this is just a minimalist, minimalist wallet. I'm going to see if it's going to work out for me, because I think it's going to. So this has um, slots to put cards in uh, right here. This also has a uh, slot in the a pocket in the middle. 
And then it's got these slots on the front to where I could slide my all-access all pass. And then, um, could I do, uh, eh, I don't know what I'm going to do with the second slot there, but I'll figure that out. But let's see if uh, this is going to work out for me. So, I'm going to take my cards here, and I'm going to start putting them in these card slots in the back so already I can tell that that is not going to be a problem so it's going to hold my cards just fine all the cards that I had in there so now I have left my ID and some of my permits there let's see if I can slide those in there I can, not too tight. If I needed to pull out my ID, I could just pull that out and flash that. So that's gonna work just fine. Now what am I gonna do with my cash? Um, the cash, I suppose, I could actually, you know what? I can put all these cards in the back slot here so I had the six cards divided up between the two slots I can take my cash now and just slip it into that front pocket and now that really works this is I'm gonna say that this is a good replacement for this and you can see how used and abused this guy has. I would say this would end up probably being my most carried item in the last eight years. This hasn't changed. Um, floss pick. You know me. I always have to have a backup floss pick. There we go. I got a spot for my floss pick now. I even got one of the... Uh, Whoops, I'm knocking shit over on my desk. Well, it can't be too far from me. They're not. I always have... Lately, I'm using the Oral-B Charcoal Mint Floss Picks. And just as a backup, I know it's kind of gross to carry a toothpick uh, like in your wallet. But in case of emergency, I don't mind a little bit of... Uh, I'll clean it off if I have to, but right now, haha, -ha, I have my floss pick, my all access pass. I have six cards, some cash, and then you see here, um, this is, let's see. Um, this is my, uh, license. This is my, uh, um, I'm a registered libertarian all life. Uh, not to get political, but yeah, now you know. Um, I have my Washington State concealed, uh, uh, pistol license. And I have my, uh, water, my Oregon State, uh, concealed handgun license. So this is one, two, three, four items. That I'm able to now tuck into the center slot. Let's see if I put my yeah this works and now if I have to pull out my wallet and I have to slide it out my I can just pull out my ID. I don't have the window to show but that's not a big deal. I like this. Yay! Yay! Finally a wallet that's going to work, and it's super minimalist. And then uh, maybe I'll pop that coin off of there. Or I got a couple of different... I got some hobo coins and whatnot that I really like. Um, maybe I'll uh, affix one to that, too. And then I got uh, a coin with me also. So, um, yay. Uh, I'm very happy about that. Again, this is the uh, Urban Companion Black 3-slot. I don't know why it's a three slot because it's only got two slots. I don't know. There's a couple different versions. They, I think they make it in a brown. 
Um, uh, but yeah, um, I don't know if you can see it. No, I had to switch back to my webcam because my I made an earlier video with a different setup. Uh, long story, but this does have the Urban EDC um, logo on it. I don't have my, oop, let's see here, in my knife drawer, my, bo my box of knife drawers, um, this is the Urban, so this is the, the Vox logo with Urban EDC, but their, their logo is just the, um, uh, let's see, does I have it on here? Do I have a card in here? There we go. That is their, that's the Urban EDC Supply logo, and it is stamped into the center here. It's just my lighting is garbage when I'm using this one. Um, I can always put a coin right there, too. Yeah, um, I don't know that uh, this is going to be my be-all, end-all solution um, to my wallet situation. I really want to check out one of Lancelot Leather's wallets also. Um, I think that that one could be just as good. I haven't gotten around to ordering one yet, but, uh, Lancelot Leather makes some really, really cool shit also. So, um, I'm probably going to check that out and, um, you know, uh, if I like that one better, uh, I'll probably do some sort of a giveaway at this point and, uh, give this wallet away. Or on the offhand, maybe I don't like the Lancelot Leather one as much as I like this one. I'll give that uh, one away, but uh, I'm not making any assumptions yet. I definitely want to check that out. Um, but anyway, this is a good, awesome option for a minimalist wallet if uh, that's what you dudes or gals. Um, wallets aren't just for dudes. Uh, if that is the kind of wallet that tickles your fancy, regardless of uh, your gender, maybe check one out. I don't know. Thanks, everybody. Uh, that's it for now. Um, I'm wearing the same shirt that uh, I am in the last one. Actually, shout out to Barbered by Wendy. How dope of a shirt is this? Got this today. Uh, my cousin, uh, Wendy, uh, is a barber. She actually, that's why my beard looking so tight right now. Went in and got a trim, and she got these new shirts in. And uh, I got one. Uh, it's awesome. Barbered by Wendy. Uh, if you uh, happen to reside uh, in the Snohomish County uh, area of Washington or you're visiting and you need a trim uh, for your luscious mane, check out Barbered by Wendy. Um, hit me up on Instagram uh, and I'll uh, send you a link or check out Barbered by Wendy on uh, Instagram also. Thanks, everybody. Until the next one. Oh, uh, this is the night before Thanksgiving, so... Um, happy Thanksgiving to all you kind folks out there in, um, the universe. I hope you have a excellent, uh, holiday. You're able to spend some time with your friends and family. Uh, the ones, uh, that you, uh, you know, care for the most. That's what Thanksgiving is all about, in my opinion. And eating a shit ton of food. That's also my favorite part of it. Thanks, everybody. Talk to you on the next one. Deuces.